Right, well, apart from the messy floor, and probably a puddle down there from last time I was in Dover, it's <laughs> still not dried up for the water. Um, yeah, you know, when you always come out and you know something's going to go wrong, and you, oh, it's one of those nights where uh, it's not raining, but it's still windy up here. We're out for the, um, what is it, Thursday Night Net, Channel 39 CB. And um, it's just got here, and oh, yeah, you know, I've got the radios in the back of the van. I've got a little comfy swivel office chair thing, and coffee, little take, little shelf thing, blah blah blah. Well, with the work I do, I've got to empty the van, you know, two, three times a day sometimes for different jobs. And uh, today I had to go and deliver um, a bloody oh, mobility chair, whatever you call it, those electric chairs that people can sit in them and they move up and down. And um, so I emptied the van out for that, and uh, yeah, well, let's, oh, let's leave the keys in the ignition so I don't lose them. My oh god, it's windy, I can't open the door! Ugh, well, uh, yeah, I delivered the chair, and they asked me to take the old one away. So, <laughs> I forgot to take it to the tip. Well, ran out of time, got busy. So it looks like I'm going to be DXing tonight <laughs> from a wing back. <laughs> a nice wing back. It's in good nick, not all of it. I was going to donate it to a charity shop, but as, um, the fire label's been cut off. It's still quite new. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm going to be in the back of the van tonight. <laughs> in a wing back. <laughs> Comfy or what? Let's get some light on there, yeah. Yeah, it's better. Right, catch you later. Yeah, Rog, yeah, that's the problem with being down there um, low. And all the noise level from the buildings and shops and so on. Yeah, it's a bad one. Yeah, just sitting here chilling back in my wing back. Radio. Coffee. Uh, it's hard work, this is, you know. Anyway, I'm going to get some sleep. Right. Not sure if that's recording. I hope so. Didn't mind. Well, it was a good little net tonight. It was really casual. Just a few of us on it. And a right old laugh. And then a car kept coming into the car park. Coming up really... Oh, shit. Nearly hit someone. Why do people cross the road when you're reversing? So... Anyway, yeah, a car came in, kept coming up close to me in the other van that's there, we both of sort of radioing together, as it were. And, um, yeah, they keep pulling upside, and I noticed it last week sometime, someone pulled upside, shouted, Aah! out the window, and drove off. And last week or the other day, I thought they were shouting maybe at another car that was parked there, like friends or someone like that. And then tonight I realised they were shouting at me or the other guy that was up there. So tonight, after they drove into the car park about three times, getting close, shining their lights, trying to see through the window in there, um, they decided to park on the road, multiple occupants, um, run across the car park on foot, kick the shit out of the side of the van, nearly spilled my coffee, right? nearly spilled my fucking coffee, which I think was my word because I was transmitting at the time, and um, I, you know, flew out the back door as quick as I could. Um, but in the second it took me to get out my comfy chair um, and out the back door, they were just getting in the car and drove off. And they were driving up and down all night, you know, slowly past the car park all that. I went out and waved around them some sort of metal bar, as you do. And then when they came back about the third time, I was in the car park, crawled up slowly, put on my lights heading towards the exit and they shot off and had to um, overtake like another car to get away from me so I kind of like gave chase a little bit um, you know this is a van for the radio gear I didn't, I couldn't go flat out like I have done in the past uh, if the van was empty I might go a little bit fast you know in the middle of nowhere I'm only going to kill myself so yeah little fuckers got away um, no damage to the van I don't think they just got out and all sorts kicking it and banging it shaking it and then ran off again um, but yeah kind of ruined the last hour of my night 
Ooh, parking space. Ooh, ooh. Uh, we'll squeeze in there. Yeah, no idea what make or model the car was. All I could see was the shape of the back lights and um, you know the colour off the headlights. They were white. They weren't like orange or yellow. They were white. These new well, was a new modern car. Um, so yeah, couldn't see the number plate because the back lights were so bright. Couldn't read it. Um, no, no ID on the car or the occupants. Some quite gutted really. But if you're watching this, I'm gonna fucking have you, and I'm gonna fuck you up. So please do try it again. Because I will have you. In fact, I'm so confident, I'll have you twice. Don't care how many's in the car. Four or five. Come up there again. And I'll let you. Oh, there you go, just clicked. I'll let you have a closer look at my little friend. I'll wrap it round your head. Because it's going through your windscreen. Apart from that, good night. Good fun on the radio. And um, yeah, comfy chair.